We've done two this morning. Uh, the first involved uh, a 19 month old baby. So I knew that would be very short and who knows what I'd get. Um, and then I've had a family um, which, which was ex meant to be chaos, but actually they were much easier to work with than I expected. I was, I was worried about whether the timings and the storytelling would work, but we had a few practice runs where everyone went through the motions of what they needed to do. And it was great. We all threw ideas about. It was very, very interactive, coming up with gags on the spot. Um, and yeah, the, the first results are great. I'm really excited. Gabriel's finished. So Gabriel's going to slowly yeah, wipe the ground. I'm actually happily surprised. So bring on the next one. <laughs> Tim's great. He's really, really good to work with. He makes it easy. He really talks you through every step of the way. So you feel like you know what you're doing, even though you don't. Um, he's lovely. He's great with the kids. Mark's a dentist, not a natural actor, and he did great. So yeah, loads of fun. Really enjoyed it. Hi, I'm, um, I'm editing today. Uh, the stop motion animation with Tim Allen. As you can see here, I've got a pop-up edit rig. Tim sends me the files over and then I edit a short movie together. So with the final film, you'll see the, an the actual, what's going on in the animation, but then you'll be able to sort of follow some of the content of how it's all put together on some social media, stuff like that. This was a living room set. The whole idea is to keep things very minimal. I'm seeing it like a stage. So it will literally be a couple of props to make something feel like a different environment. We've got different colored backgrounds because the idea is that we're simulating different people's apartments while they're stuck in lockdown for many months. We've got a, a handful of different Canon cameras. Uh, these all have to have Nikon lenses for stop motion to ensure that the image doesn't have too much lighting change. Um, and I'm using um, Dragon Frame software, um, fairly simple um, c computer. So it, it's been very, very much friends, residents coming together to see what equipment they can lend and um, help make this film as a collaboration. Yeah. Hmm? And then I look at the window. Yeah, look at the window and you're going to walk. Let's just have a look. Yeah, it's nice to get a good face, a good full face. So yeah, that... What? Look at this corner, what do you get? What do we get? No, I... Maybe look in the middle of this one. Yeah, I think in the middle of that board is, is nice. Get a good full frontal. <laughs> Needed to keep the smile. What we might do is speed up the walk a bit. It is a bit, quite a lot of waddling. Yeah. Right. So, and I've planned it so that it's done that when you turn it, yeah. it 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 so when you turn it this way, and there's lots of, the idea is that there's empty space compositionally up there. Yeah. You can lean forward, hold up. So the idea is to hold up in the, the blue space. So we'll uh, give me, if you want me to move you more this way. Well, yeah, the, the blue space is, um, I'm going to have to move, can, have to move right, that. Can, to there's a general structure for each shot, and depending who comes, we might then make a few creative changes, depending on what we've got available. So there'll be a quick discussion, and um, there'll be a lot of surprises. I don't know exactly how all of these are going to come out, so for me, it's all unfolding as well. But yeah, bring it on. Siri, call in Paul Nagel. Answer phone. Paul, it's Ian. Yeah, Ian Felton. Um, we've got, we're, I'm on the red carpet. It's your red carpet. You're playing Donald Trump in the spectacular Unity film. And uh, where are you? We're about to start. See you soon. Well, here we are. 
in uh, Hopewell Square, London City Island. We put a red carpet out, and this is we, what we're basically doing is we are doing a film premiere for a movie that was shot all in the space of two days as part of the Unity Festival with Tim Allen directing it and Paul Mortimer editing. We've set up a film studio. These guys have made it. This is the red carpet. We're, we're waiting for the, for the stars to turn up and we're waiting for them to press play so we can begin our show. Cheers.